Hi everyone, it's Tom Abbott here. I've got a question for you. How do you hire the best candidates for a sales role? Well, that's a question that I'm often asked by sales leaders. In fact, yesterday, I spoke with a managing director of a shipping and marine supply company who shared the following two major challenges. Number one, competition from well-branded multinational corporations for applications. And two, selecting the best candidates during the interview process. So how do you attract applicants? Well, there's lots of great ideas and I'm going to share some of them with you right now. You could look at things like strong employer branding, using LinkedIn as a recruitment tool, soliciting employee referrals, offering attractive compensation and benefits packages, and providing advancement opportunities. I mean, these are all great places to start for attracting applicants. But what I'm more interested in is how do you actually select the best candidates once you're in the interview process. So what I'm going to share with you are seven of my favorite sales interview questions. Are you ready? I hope so. Get your pen and paper out or your iPad and take notes because these are great questions to really help you qualify, to use a sales term, candidates for your sales role. So let's jump right in. Question number one, please ask them this. What are two things about this position that interest you? I mean, that question's really going to give you some clues as to what motivates them and what is it exactly about the job that they're interested in. Is it the opportunities to work with people and serve customers and hustle and sell? Or is it just the vacation that they're interested in, right? So what are two things about this position that interest you? Question number two, who was your least favorite manager? Why? And who was your favorite and why? This question will give you great clues as to how do you need to manage this person and might even give you some red flags that uh, you may need to avoid <laughs> having this person on your team. So who was your least favorite manager and why? And who was your favorite and why? Question number three. As a salesperson, what do you see as your most important role and secondary role? Come on, you want to find out, do they see their most important role as sitting by the phone and being an order taker waiting for that phone to ring? Or do they see their most important role as a prospecting one where they go out and meet customers? Ask them that question. I love that one. Question four. What would you say is the most difficult part of selling and why? You want to learn more about some of their, weak their weaknesses, their weak areas, right? So what do they find most difficult and why? Question five. What was the last sales book you read and what did you learn? Man, you'd be surprised at how many salespeople haven't even read a sales book ever, or at least not recently. So what was the last sales book they read and what did they learn? Question number six. Think about the last lost sale. What went wrong? What did you learn from it and what would you do differently? Question number seven. What part of the sales process do you like the most? And what part of the sales process do you like the least? <laughs> These are great questions to really get into the head of the candidate. And what I love about them is that they are sales specific questions. These are behavioral questions and I love these ones. So you can actually probably see in, in the link below, I've included a link so that you can download even more questions. So how do you attract candidates now? What questions are you asking to select the best candidates? I would love to hear from you. So please leave you know, a reply or a comment below and share some of your favorite questions. Which ones of this, from this list did you find most interesting? What are your favorites and what did I miss? Are there some other great sales interview questions that you would love to share? I'd love to hear from you. Anyway, that's all the time I've got for now. It's Tom Abbott here and I'll see you next time.